Have you reflected back at all about how wild a ride this four years has been for you? I mean, <laughs> coming here in one position, small town Colorado, and now you're Big 12 Offensive Lineman of the Year about to go to the draft. And yeah. what this four years has been like? Well, um, I guess I have a few, you know, a few weeks here just to do a little reflection. And yeah, it's been a wild ride. Um, you know, when Coach Hawk was fired, I kind of I thought about that a lot too. How much we'd been through, and um, how much he'd helped me, and how much the staff has changed my life and everything. And yeah, it's it's just been such a transition. You know, it's it's definitely put my life in a different direction than I thought it'd be, and I, I'm I'm really loving it right now. So. Last few weeks, you've seen a lot of the <coughs> former buffs maybe around the program more than they had been visible. Do you envision that being you, a guy who once you leave here though, you still need blocking goals? Oh yeah. Around, out, sounding board, whatever it might be. Yeah. Um, you know, I didn't win a whole lot of games with the teams here, but I think the crap that I've been through, man, I love this place. You know, it's just, <laughs> it's unbelievable. You know, I mean it, man. Uh, uh, yeah, this is, this is a place that's touched me and will always be in my heart, definitely. And I, I hope to come to as many games as I can, and and I've already been talking to some of the guys that I played with that we're gonna make sure we come back together and you know be together because they're relationships I'd like to keep. So. Anyone talk to you about donating two million dollars like Sue did in Nebraska? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> no, no one's come out. Of it. Yeah, but I did when I got. <laughs> yeah. I mean, I did get a funny email though, right when I yeah, after I graduated, like as alumni, would you like to donate? <laughs> I'm like, still here. <laughs> Yeah, no money. Yeah. Hey, Nate, what was the low point here for you? The low point? Um, you know, the low point is the negativity. Um, when you're working so hard, you're doing everything that you can, and people are just telling you you're just not good enough. And uh, that comes from media, that comes from fans, that comes from your coaches, that comes from everyone. And that's just, I, th I think that's the low point. When you're doing everything that you can, it's just not good enough.